First of all, setters and every sporting dog or gun dog has to have a soft expression around their head. A soft expression is exactly this, but we're going to emphasize it a little bit by grooming right now. Uh, your Irish setter and your Gordon setter, an English cocker and an American cocker, actually have a longer leather of ear. English setters seem to be the shortest leathered ear dogs in that family. So instead of shaving, like we, um, we used to shaving part, top part of the ear on most setters and cockers, on an English setter, the only part that's shaved is right in the back of the ear. If you take your hand and kind of hug the back of the ear, this is the part that's being shaved. I'm going to use a 30 blade, a 30 setting on my Bravera and shave the back of the ear pretty close in the back as well and I am not going to go all the way to the front because I would like to leave that fringe around his cheek to make a soft appearance. So I'm going to leave this alone and just expose the back part of the ear. If I were to shave the same amount of leather on an English setter as I would on an Irish setter or even an English cocker or a Springer, just imagine it goes all the way down here and that's tiny little piece of leather left, it's going to take away from the soft appearance. It's going to look a little harder. So this is going to be clean of hair right here. Also, I'm going to try and keep every part of this dog's everything, head, body, feet, furnishings, as natural as possible. In my opinion, they're soft and elegant and sharp edges, even on the furnishings, kind of take away from the softness and elegance. So I like to keep it natural.